University Challenge. Asking the questions, Jeremy Paxman. Hello, time to stick a broom handle under the beds of students and see what's there apart from the usual horrible things. Now, both teams playing tonight represent institutions that have won this competition in the past. Admittedly, on the first of those occasions, Harold Wilson was in number 10 about a quarter of a century before tonight's lot were even born. But no doubt such rich heritage will spur them both on to extraordinary things. Now, the University of Durham is the third oldest university in England, and the granting of its royal charter was one of the last acts of William IV before he died in 1837. It operates a collegiate system, but one that reflects students' pastoral concerns rather than teaching, and so it enters this competition as a single entity. Alumni include the novelist Pat Barker and Minette Walters, the England cricketers Andrew Strauss and Nasser Hussein, the former Sunday Times editor Sir Harold Evans, the actor James Wilby, and the great helmswoman of Blue Peter, Biddy Baxter. Tonight's team represents an institution that took the trophy in 1977 and 2000 with an average age of 20, playing on behalf of around 18,000 students. Let's meet the Durham team. Hello, I'm Charles. I'm from Sutton in Surrey, and I'm studying philosophy. Hi, my name's William. I'm from Kirby Stephen in Cumbria, and I'm studying biosciences. This is their captain. Hi, I'm Joe. I'm from London, and I'm studying chemistry. Hi, I'm Arthur. I'm from Manchester. I'm studying French and German. Trinity College Cambridge was founded in 1546 by Henry VIII and now has the largest body of undergraduates in the university. Its library, designed by Christopher Wren, houses a statue of the former student Lord Byron, intended for Westminster Abbey before it was declined on account of his disreputable ways. Other poets on Trinity's list of alumni include Marvell, Dryden and Hausmann. The philosophers Bertrand Russell and Ludwig Wittgenstein went there, as did the Prime Ministers Balfour and Baldwin and the spies Burgess and Maclean. Champions in 1974, 1995 and 2014 with an average age of 21 and representing around 1,000 students, let's meet the Trinity team. Hi, my name is Nadia Haurahan. I'm from Dublin and I'm reading English. Hello, I'm Lillian Crawford. I'm from Beersted in Kent and I'm reading history. This is their captain. Hi, I'm Joseph Weber. I'm originally from Bury St Edmunds in Suffolk and I'm doing maths. Hi, I'm Liam Hughes. I'm originally from Cardiff, and I'm also doing maths. OK, you all know the rules, so fingers on the buzzers. Here's your first starter for ten. In use since the Middle Ages to mean a failure to fulfil a legal obligation, what seven-letter word is used in sport to refer to a win by the disqualification or withdrawal of an opponent? Durham Cooper. Default. Correct, yes. The first set of bonuses are on cave systems, Durham. Discovered by teenage boys in 1940, what cave system in the Dordogne is the location of a series of Paleolithic paintings, chiefly of large animals? Lascaux. Lascaux. Lascaux is correct. Said to be capable of holding 40 Boeing 747 aircraft, the Sarawak chamber is part of the Mulu cave system on which large island? Borneo. Correct. The Witch's Kitchen is a chamber in which series of limestone caves named after a village near Wells in Somerset? Cheddar. 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 Yeah, yeah. Cheddar? No, it's Wookie Hole. Ten points for this. The origins of which African country's name lie in the Portuguese for River of Prawns? The name was given to the Wuri River estuary by 15th and 16th century explorers. Located a few degrees north of the equator, it was a German protectorate until 1916 and gained its independence from British and French rule in 19... Durham Thames. Cameroon. Cameroon is correct. <laughs> right, you get a set of bonuses on sporting positions. Firstly, which specific position in football represents the last line of defence before the goalkeeper? The word in question appears in the name of a vessel that detects and destroys objects underwater. Sweeper. 
Sweeper. Sweeper is correct. In cricket, what is the name of the fielding position between point and the slips? It's thought to be derived from an alternative name for the esophagus. Oh, is it gully? Gully. Yeah, it's gully. Gully. Gully is correct. Meaning free. Which Italian word is used in volleyball for a specialised defensive player who is only allowed in the back row and wears a different colour shirt? Libero? Libero is right, yes. <laughs> Ten points for this. What two-digit number links in Mahayana iconography the major physical characteristics of the Buddha, in music the number of complete piano sonatas composed by Beethoven, and in binary notation a one followed by five zeros? Trinity Hughes. 32. 32 is correct. <laughs> you get a set of bonuses on scientific memoirs, Trinity. What name for a general type of Nidarian appears in the subtitle of Spineless, a 2017 memoir by the US scientist Julie Burwald? Jellyfish. Jellyfish. Yeah, I think you're right. Jellyfish. Correct. The name of what primate appears in the title of Diane Fossey's 1983 memoir of her researches in Rwanda? Gor gorillas. Correct. Yeah. Denoting a general group of cartilaginous fish, what single word completes the title of a memoir by the US zoologist Eugenie Clark, the lady and the... Fish. fish. That rhymes with tramp, possibly. Carp. Um, Carp. Carp. No, it's sharks. Right, ten points for this. In the OED, Limehouse and San Francisco appear in early citations of what word denoting a distinctive area of a city? That of Manila is said to have been the earliest, while other notable examples are located in Yokohama, Melbourne and the area... Durham Cooper. Chinatown? Chinatown is correct, yes. Right, your bonuses this time are on battles named after rivers. In each case, name the battle from the description. First, a battle of July 1690 in County Meath between Jacobite and Williamite forces. Battle of the Boyne, isn't it? Battle of the Boyne? Yeah. Is it? yeah. Battle of the Boyne? Correct. Secondly, a battle of 1939 between three British cruisers and the German Admiral Graf Spee. It is named after an estuary in South America. The River Plate, yeah. Battle of the River Plate. Correct. And finally, a prolonged battle from July to November 1916. It's named after a river that rises near Saint-Quentin in Picardy. Yeah. Uh, the Battle of the Somme. Correct. <laughs> We're going to take a picture around now. For your picture starter, I would like the name of the country whose national flag results from taking the colours that form part of the names of the three geographical locations given and placing them in the order shown. Durham Towns. Ireland. Ireland is correct, yes. Greenland, the White Sea and Orange County. So, following on from the Irish flag, your bonuses are three more national flags for you to construct from the given clues. In other words, a colour within the name of the location or feature arranged in the order shown. Firstly... Oh, dear. It's These are colours. Black Forest. Is that yellow now? No, it's not that. That's not that's mm -hmm. um, that's not, no, that's uh, is that the white Nile or the blue Nile? That's the Yukon Territory. Yeah, is that white or blue Nile? White. The white. Um, so we've got white. Um, it could be Estonia. If, okay. if it's that. blue. Yeah, go for that then. Estonia? Correct, yes. Yeah, the nice. blue Nile, the black forest and the white horse. Secondly. Mm, I don't know. It's the red sea. So it's Green Park? Yes, yeah, Green Park. Yellowstone. Green, so. red. Oh, no. that's Lithuania. 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 That is correct. Yellowstone, Green Park, and Red Sea. And finally. Yeah. That's the Yellow Sea. Yellow Sea. And. and uh, it might be Baton Rouge. Baton Rouge. Yeah. Baton Rouge. So, Baton Rouge. Yeah, that was. So Belgium. 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 If it's black, yellow, red, it's Belgium. Yeah, Belgium. No, it's Romania. It's the Blue Ridge Mountains you missed. Uh, the Yellow Sea, Baton Rouge, of course. Ten points for this. Which prominent 19th-century Russian mathematician proved Joseph Bertrand's conjecture 
that a prime ah. must exist. Trinity Hughes. Chebyshev. Chebyshev is correct, yes. <laughs> so you're going to set the bonuses now on artists who were also muses to others. Firstly, the Parisian artist and singer Kiki de Montparnasse was the muse of which surrealist photographer? In his Le Violon d'Ingres, he superimposed the F-holes of a violin on a study of her torso. Man Ray. Correct. Who painted his fellow impressionist Berta Morisot numerous times, including two works of 1872 depicting her with a bouquet of violets and with a fan? Manet. Manet. Manet is correct. Elizabeth Siddle exhibited with the Pre-Raphaelites and was also the model for many works, including Beata Beatrix, by which member of the Brotherhood whom she married in 1860? Millet. Millet. No, it was Rossetti. Ten points for this. Which century of the Common Era saw the building of the Angkor Wat Temple, the Jurchen invasion of the Song Empire in China, the establishment of the Kamakura Shogunate in Japan and the founding of the Knights Templar. Uh, Trinity Crawford. The 14th. Anyone like to buzz from Durham? Durham Raffle. 13th. No, it was the 12th. Ten points for this. The premieres of Wagner's Tannhauser and Gershwin's Rhapsody in Blue both occurred within the lifetime of which French composer? A pupil of Saint-Saëns, his works include the opera Penelope, and the orchestral piece, Pavan. Trinity Weber. Foray. Foray is correct. <laughs> These bonuses are on elements in the periodic table, Trinity. The name of which artificially produced transuranium element is derived from that of a US state and begins with the three-letter name of a number? Tennessee. 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 Tennessee is correct. Used in aircraft construction, which element has a name that begins with the three-letter name of birds whose species include the bearded and the blue? Titanium. Titanium. Titanium's correct. Highly ductile and resistant to most common acids, which element has a name that begins with a three-letter word, meaning to convert hide into leather? Tantalum. Yes, that's right. Tantalum. Tantalum is right. Ten points for this. Comprising the oaks, Quercus is the largest genus in a family of trees often known by what five-letter common name? The same name is also given to Fagus sylvatica, a tall tree that bears triangular nuts in prickly ah. seed cases. Trinity Weber. No, sorry, Birch. No, you lose five points. Anyone like to buzz from Durham? Durham Town. Cedar. Oh, it's a beach. Ten points for this. The Orchard Keeper was the first novel by which US author, born in 1933 and known for his work in the Western and Southern Gothic genres. His works include All the Pretty Horses, Blood Meridian ah, and... Trinity Harahan. Uh, Cormac McCarthy. Cormac McCarthy is correct, yes. <laughs> you get three bonuses, Trinity, on the architect Amanda Levitt. With an innovative semi-monocoque structure, once described as an alarm clock on stilts, Levitz works as part of future systems, include the 1999 winner of the Sterling Prize, the media centre at which cricket ground? Lords. 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 It is at Lords, yes. Levitz's major projects with her own practice include the Museum of Art, Architecture and Technology in which European capital city? Likened to an oyster shell, it sits at the north end of the city's 25th of April bridge. Um, Budapest? No, it's Lisbon. 2017 saw the completion of Levitt's extension to which London museum? It comprises a new underground gallery space and a porcelain tiled courtyard that opens onto Exhibition Road. Is that the V&A? I think it is yeah, the V&A. The V&A. Correct. <laughs> right, we're going to take a music round now. If you're a music starter, you'll hear a piece of popular music. Ten points if you can name the solo artist singing. Everybody's doing a brand new dance. Trinity Crawford. Kylie Minogue. It is Kylie Minogue. Well done. 
That was her version of The Locomotion, which was co-written by Carole King, one of the most prolific songwriters of the 20th century. Your music bonuses? Three more songs written or co-written by King. Name the artist or the band performing in each case. Firstly, this band... No, that's the Shirelles, Will You Still Love Me Tomorrow. Secondly, this artist... You just James Taylor. It is James Taylor, yes, you've got a friend. <laughs> and finally, this artist... When my show yeah. was in the Aretha Franklin. It is Natural Woman. <laughs> right, ten points for this. From the Latin for related to, what linear two-dimensional geometric transformation in mathematics preserves collinearity and ratios of distances? Durham Cooper. Translation? No, anyone want to buzz from Trinity? Trinity Weber. A conformal mapping. No, it's an affine transformation. Right, ten points for this. Give the four-letter name of the kingdom traditionally said to have been formed by the union of the Picts and Scots under <laughs> Kenneth... Durham Thames. Alba. Alba is correct, yes. <laughs> you get three bonuses on scientific terms, Durham. From the Greek for thread, what name is given to the diverse phylum also called the roundworms? Yeah, just uh, nematodes. Correct. Members of what phylum can produce a nematocyst, a form of intracellular stinging capsule? It's the only phylum to produce them. Um, tenophores, maybe? Hold on. Got tenophores. 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 Tenophores? No, it's nidaria. And finally, nematic and smectic are terms used in connection with what type of substance? Widely used in visual displays in electronic devices. I need a two-word term. Yeah. Liquid crystal. Correct. <laughs> Ten points for this. In material science, for what do the letters TP stand in abbreviations such as TPE and TPV? The term in question refers to a material that can be reheated and reshaped. Trinity Weber. Thermoplastic. Thermoplastic is correct. <laughs> Get these bonuses, you'll retake the lead. They're on the author Elizabeth Gaskell. Subtitled A Tale of Manchester Life. In which of Gaskell's novels does the title character reject her working class lover in favour of a mill owner's son? North and South? North and South. No, it's Mary Barton. Which novel by Gaskell concerns a young orphan who gives birth to an illegitimate son? The title figure shares her name with a book of the Old Testament. Yes, it's Ruth, Ruth. Ruth. Ruth is correct. John Thornton and Margaret Hale are characters in which novel by Gaskell, originally serialised in the periodical Household Words? Should we go? Should we go in North and South? Should we go in North and South? I think North and South. Okay. Are you sure? I don't know for certain. North and South. Correct. Ten points for this. What term denotes an arrangement of five objects as if Four are placed ah. on each... Trinity Hughes. Quincunx. Correct. <laughs> These bonuses are on an English town, Trinity. Which town on the River Trent shares its name with an 18th-century Suffolk-born portrait and landscape painter? Gainsborough. Gainsborough. Correct. Secondly, known by a descriptive by-name, which Danish king began his conquest of England from Gainsborough in 1013 and died there shortly afterwards. Harold Harefoot. No, it was Sven Forkbeard. And finally, which novel of 1860 features the town of St Ogg's, thought to have been based on Gainsborough? It's Middlemarch. Or is it Middlemarch? I think it's Middlemarch. 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 No, it's the mill on the floss. Oh, <laughs> Another picture around now. If your picture starter, you'll see a painting. 
now widely believed to be a copy of a lost original. The 10 points simply give the surname of the artist to whom the original is attributed. Trinity Crawford. Bruegel. Bruegel is correct, yes. <laughs> that was Bruegel's landscape with the fall of Icarus, which inverts the Renaissance hierarchy of genre by placing scenes of everyday life in the foreground and its mythological subject in the background. Your picture bonuses, three more examples of that, all from the early 1600s. Firstly, who painted this portrait, which includes a depiction of Christ and the disciples in the top left corner? Okay. Velasquez. That is correct, yes. Kitchen made with the supper at Emmaus. Secondly, who painted this work, which depicts a biblical scene using the conventions of genre painting? Is that, um, is that not Rembrandt? It could be. I think it looks like Rembrandt. Yeah. Rembrandt. No, that's Caravaggio. And finally, the painter of these mythological figures, a specialist collaborator, added the unusually prominent still life elements. Should we go Titian? Titian. No, that's Rubens. Ten points for this. Who wrote these lines? Here and here did England help me. How can I help England? Say, whoso turns as I this evening, turn to God to praise and pray. They appear in his 1845 poem, Home Thoughts from the Sea. Durham Raffle. Robert Browning. Correct. <laughs> These bonuses are films based on French-language comics. With a cast including Steve Buscemi, Simon Russell Beale and Michael Palin, which 2017 film by Armando Iannucci is based on a satirical... The Death of Stalin is correct. Secondly, which 2013 film by Abde Latif Kashish is an adaptation of a French graphic novel by Julie Marrow? It tells the story of a love affair between the shy student Adele and the artist Emma. Uh, pass. It was Blue is the Warmest Colour. Which French-Iranian cartoonist wrote and directed the 2007 animated film Persepolis, an adaptation of her graphic novel of the same name? Okay. Pass. It was Majani Satrapi. Ten points for this. In contrast to a combination where the order does not matter... Trinity Hughes. Permutation. Permutation is right, yes. <laughs> Your bonuses this time are on Chinese Emperor's Trinity. In each case, name one year during the lifetime of the following. Firstly, the Emperor Wen Di, his father, Liu Bang, founded the Han Dynasty... Wen Di's reign was one of sound government and peaceful consolidation. Any clue? Um, try 700. 700. Okay. 700. No, that's 203 to 157 BC. <laughs> Second, Yang Qian. He reunified China after 300 years' instability and founded the Sui dynasty. Any clue? Pass. That was 541 to 604 in the Common Era. And finally... Xuan Zung, the longest reigning emperor of the Tang dynasty. Thirteen fifty. No, that's six eight five to seven six two common era. Right, ten points for this. Born Mireille Suzanne Francette Port in nineteen forty seven. What is the professional name of the French artist whose work in the nineteen nineties centered on her undergoing cosmetic surgical procedures? Trinity Harahan. Orlan. Orlan is correct, yes. <laughs> you get three questions on chemistry for your bonuses, Trinity. What term describes the structure of molecules whose bond angles are set at 180 degrees? An example is carbon dioxide. Um, linear. 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 Linear is right. Also known as acane, what simple compound is often cited as an example of trigonal pyramidal molecular structure? Um, a boron um, trihydride, is it? Uh, uh, boron, tri boron, tri boron trifluoride. No, it's ammonia. Related to a platonic solid, what term describes the molecular structure of methane? Tetra tetrahedral. Correct. Ten points for this. At the age of 16, Amy Tinkler, Team GB's youngest competitor in the Rio Olympics, won a bronze medal in which sport? Durham Cooper. Gymnastics. 
Gymnastics is correct. <laughs> Your bonuses are on Thunder this time. Thunder Bay in northwest Ontario is a major port on which large body of water? No. No. Yeah. Is it Lawrence Bay? Yeah, I, yeah uh, it must be. Hudson Bay. No, it's Lake Superior. A traditional structure with large red pillars, the Thunder Gate is an entrance to Sen Soji, a temple and leading tourist attraction in which capital city? Tokyo. It's got to be Tokyo. Uh, Tokyo? Correct. What the Thunder said is the title of the fifth and final part of which major poem of the early 20th century? Uh, Wasteland. Wasteland. The Wasteland is correct. Ten points for this. <laughs> Give answers to both of them promptly. What names were adopted in the 19th century for the Irish towns now known as Dunleary and Cove? Trinity Howerham. Kingstown and Queenstown. Correct. <laughs> so your bonus is they're on recent winners of the Booker Prize. In each case, give the name of the book from its year of publication and its first words. From 2009, so now get up, felled, dazed, silent. He has fallen, knocked full length on the cobbles of the yard. And Enright the Gathering. No, it's Hilary Mantel's Wolf Hall. From 2013, secondly, the 12 men congregated in the smoking room of the Crown Hotel gave the impression of a party accidentally met. What was that? 2013. Was it Howard Jacobson, that the yeah. Finkler question? Okay. Come Nominate on. Hughes. Howard Jacobson, the Finkler question? Uh, no, it's Eleanor Catton's The Luminaries. And finally, from 2014, listen, dead people never stop talking, maybe because death isn't death at all. Just a detention after school. 2014, um, I, I mean, I don't know. Pass. It's Marlon James's A Brief History of Seven Killings. Right, ten points for this. In physics, what specific adjective is applied to an atom or an orbiting electron or a nucleus at a state of higher energy than its ground state? <laughs> Trinity Weber. Excited. The excited is correct. <laughs> These bonuses are on Biblical Patriarchs, Trinity. His name meaning father of many nations, which patriarch is considered the father of the Jewish people and in the Quran is the ancestor of Muhammad and at the Dom, Durham University had 145, Trinity College Cambridge have 200. The answer was Abraham, of course. Well, Durham, I think 145. You're about in the area you need to be in to come back as one of the four highest scoring losers. We'll see, though. Uh, Trinity, many congratulations to you, so we look forward to seeing you in round two. I hope you can join us next time for another first-round game. Until then, though, it's goodbye from Durham University. Goodbye. Bye. It's goodbye from Trinity College, Cambridge. Bye. Goodbye. And it's goodbye from me. Goodbye. <laughs>